Hello everybody, this is Balto Racing. Um, this is basically just a video to describe what the new Jeff Gordon series is going to be about. Um, it's going to be basically every nine races. So after Talladega, we'll have the first episode. It's going to be center centered around, say like, school or something like that. Um, just like classes, it's going to... I'm going to have like eight different areas like you would represent classes. I'll go over exactly the grading in a moment, but first I'll go over the eight areas. The first one is pretty self-explanatory, which is qualifying. Basically, where Jeff qualifies on Friday, if he does well, it increases the chances of a good pit position, stuff like that. Um, for the rest of the uh, categories, it's going to be based off the race itself. So the second area is going to be based on the short runs. In other words, how does Jeff's car, how the car goes off on a restart, how many positions does he lose, how many does he gain, how does the tire pressures come up, how quickly the tires lose their goodness or whatever you want to call it, <laughs> you know, stuff like that. Um, the third one is going to be the long runs. Now, obviously, it's very tough to have a great short run car and a very good long run car. It's just, that's probably one of the hardest things to do if you're a crew chief. But, of course, you would try your best to make sure that one area isn't as bad as it can be. So, we'll look at that, you know, how does Steve Attard set up the car and things like that. That would judge the grading for that. Now, area number four is going to be based on the communication. Now, it's going to be basically between, I think mostly between Jeff, Steve Letard, and um, Spotter Shannon Montgomery. Um, basically, if everybody's on the same page, if everybody's on the same page, then they're going to probably get a good grade. But if there's a race that they're not, it's just, we'll see. We'll see. Um, the next one is going to be pitch strategy. Now, this is basically two tires, four tires, and also the adjustments that Steve Letart would decide to make on pit road. Now, sometimes these adjustments these adjustments work, sometimes they don't. So, you know, I'll look into that as well. Area number six is going to focus on the pit crew. Um, so far this year, through the first four races, they've done a pretty good job. Um, very consistent pit stops, very few mistakes, and the mistakes they do make, they cover pretty quickly. So, they're doing a great job right now. Let's see if they can continue that during the season. Um, the next one is going to be the spotter, which is Shannon Montgomery. Um, he's been Jeff Gordon's uh, spotter for quite a while now. One of the best spotters, if you ask me, in the Cup Series. So, that should be an easy, easy A, if you ask me. And the last one will be like the last few laps of a race. How do you finish the deal? If you have a chance to win, do you capitalize? Do you capitalize on a good day and turn into a great day, a bad day into a good day? That is going to be the gist of that particular topic. Now, as far as the grading goes, um, I'm going to basically do it like, I'll say, a normal public school system. Not like a private school, which is like usually a seven point system. So it's pretty simple. 90 to 100 is an A. 80 to 89 is a B. 70 to 79 is a C. A D is going to be 60 to 69, and anything below that is an F. But quite honestly, I think this team is a little too good to be under any of those kind of circumstances so I don't think personally I'll have to use any of those or maybe not even D because this is truly if you ask me in my opinion a championship team we just got to put all the pieces together and just make it all work so that's basically it um you have any questions about it just ask in the comment bar and first episode comes out in late April so take care Balto Racing